All right, guys, so first things first, we're always going to wear our goggles no matter what, okay? Now, we need a couple of things before we get started. Our pins and pin magnet, our piece for our horizontal stabilizer and our vertical stabilizer, a piece for our fuselage, and our piece for our wings. We're also going to need some scissors, our foam board for pinning down our designs, and the designs themselves. So once you have your designs and everything, you're going to be ready to cut. I'm going to grab my scissors and start cutting. And it is definitely okay if you cut a little bit outside of the lines. It might even actually be preferable, so I'm going to start doing that. That way when you're cutting the X-Acto knife on your wood, then you know exactly where you're cutting. There we go. Next we're going to take our pattern piece, our wing, and pin it to our wood. And we'll do this with all of our pieces we cut out. And I need to make sure that it goes along the grains so that when I cut perpendicular, I'm going to put about four pins in. You don't need to put that many in, just enough to hold the place on the wood while you cut. So I'm going to put two in the middle first. That way our paper is not going to go anywhere when we're cutting. And I'm going to put one over here. And one over here. All right, a quick note right here. We're gonna cut this out like a triangle and you can see that I took my pencil and drew a line from the top part right here down to the bottom and connected the dotted line with the regular straight line and made a triangle. We're gonna cut that triangle out and cut a piece of our foam board out on the next step. I have all other pieces already pinned so I'm gonna put this board aside and Here's what I've got right now, and you can see I have both stabilizers, vertical and horizontal, my fuselage and my wings ready and pinned on the wood. One thing we need to note with the vertical and the horizontal stabilizer, we want the horizontal stabilizer to go with the grain so that it has a nice clean cut. We want the vertical stabilizer to go against the grain. That way when we glue it on our plane, it's very stable and not so easy to break as it would be if we cut it with the grain. Now our next step is gonna be cutting out our pieces. So I'm gonna go ahead and get all the pieces that I've already cut out so we can start from there. 